Ben Strong from Ease Edge with a quick demo video on how to trace drawings from a blueprint. So sometimes uh, we'll have people get uh, blueprints from a builder without dimensions on them and uh, sometimes it's easier just to trace the drawings than to uh, convert them all uh, and get dimensions and measure them uh, in order to get a square foot estimate. So in this example, uh, I have this uh, blueprint and this kitchen area right here um, with an L-shaped countertop and an island. And you can see here that there's not a lot of dimensions given on this uh, countertop. I know that there's, the width of these countertops are going to be 25 and a half. So what I can do is I can take, uh, this is a PDF, so if you get it in PDF format you'll have to convert it to an image first. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just take a quick screenshot here uh, on a Mac there's a screenshot app built in and uh, there is on Windows as well. So there's there's some tutorial videos online that are you can easily find on how to take a screenshot. Uh, so here I am, I'm going to take a screenshot of this area of the kitchen and then I'll go back to my uh, drawing and I'll click this button here that says add blueprint. So I can click that and I've got my screenshot that I just created. So once I have my uh, screenshot in there, my blueprint, I can just click and trace out this uh, L-shaped countertop right there. So I can go down, go over to the pantry, down here, over, and up. Now at this point, uh, I need to just scale this shape correctly. So. Uh, I know this dimension up here at the top is 25 and a half, so I can click on that. And then I want to click, th click this uh, checkbox that says scale entire piece, which means the whole piece is going to scale up, scale up based on the dimension that I enter. So again, I know that this is 25.5, and I can cl just click done. And you see here my piece is correctly scaled up. I've got 26 and a half down here because I didn't draw it quite right, so I can adjust this. Uh, there and I'm, I'm going to have a pretty close idea of my square footage now uh, at least for estimating. Uh, so I've got 38.0 square feet uh, and if I want to do this last piece uh, I could do this as well. I do have the dimensions for this I know it's three feet by six feet um, but just to give just for the example uh, I can click this again scale the entire piece and this will be 36 inches and we'll click done and you can see that that correctly scaled this whole piece to three feet by six feet and now that I'm done uh, I can uh, remove my background image or my blueprint just by clicking remove blueprint right there and there we have it